part for population control for quite some time. <laughs> <laughs> you guys having a great night so far? Yeah! Uh, let's give another big applause to the Lafayette Hotel of the San Diego Improv Festival. Yeah! Uh, we're just going to start with a single word, and then we're going to start going from there. Metronome. 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 Thank you, one of those Metronome. things. I, I had one. I you had, had a metronome. I, I did. Oh, you had you. I so owned you for that. Yes, thank yes. you. Yes. I, uh, <laughs> they, they bought it from him. <laughs> no, I, when, I was, uh, when I was younger, much younger than I am now, a child, I would say. Um, I uh, was, never needed anybody's help in any way? No. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I played viola for uh, a number of years. Woo! Yeah! yeah left hand All right. Oh. Alto claps. She bought the viola. Yeah. yeah. All right. All right. Okay. All right. All right. There's There's other control, you heard <laughs> Anyway, um, and of course I have no rhythm, so my my instructor told me to get a metronome. It didn't help. <laughs> That's my story. How much metronome do you need for, for viola? That's not a really good <laughs> <laughs> it, was, it was a bass viola. It's a lot of counting rest. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That silence is perfectly intended. No, you came in too early, or no, what you that one beat that you had, you missed it. I, uh, we had a 20th century composer, which means you just make crap up, uh, do a residency with us in college, and uh, I was tired of his pompousness, so I just went to practice. I didn't bring my music one day, and I was like, and was, was this an acapella group? <laughs> <laughs> I was Halfway through practice, like, stop, stop, everything's terrible. You, you're awful, you're wrong. He goes, play measure 56. And I was like, oh, okay, gigs up. And I was like, bloop, bloop, bloop. And he goes, that's an F sharp. And I was like, so it is, sir. <laughs> My thoughts on you are confirmed. Great <laughs> 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 aunt was babysitting us once, and uh, we had a player piano, and we, we thought, oh, she doesn't know it's a player piano. So, <laughs> you like that? Here, sit down, sit down, we'll play you a song. And she's like, oh, really? Okay. Like that. She, she sat down, and we we're like, well, they were like, oh, hit wrong, hit wrong note, boom, oh, sorry, oh, like that. But we played virtually every piano roll that we had. And I realized, perhaps a decade later, that she was just humoring us because that kept us occupied for two full hours. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha! 
That's when you get sick. <laughs> <laughs> it's true, I've never missed a day of work in my life. Happened to my father. They gave him insurance, and two weeks later he was dead. Oh my God. <laughs> but he got a terrible blood infection. Oh my goodness, that's awful. From a paper cut. Oh no, this is all. When he opened the envelope with the card in it. <laughs> the insurance card. <laughs> Did he have a hump? 
No. <laughs> United Healthcare. <laughs> Stuffed the envelopes, and they didn't make them wash their hands. It was a big scandal. It was on all the news. Well, I still think, I still think that health insurance might be the best thing for me because that man was very convincing, and I, I don't know. I'm frightened and old. So am I. <laughs> Why is I'm the world so different? But the world is so different from what it used to be. It used to be so simple. Right. I used, to, I used to walk down the streets and I knew my place. Just like Archie and Edith said. Yes. I, I, I walked. It was so uh, simple. It was so simple. And there weren't so many colored people in my way. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here to talk to you about an internet. <laughs> I'll make it very simple for you to understand HDMI, including in the diskette, affording an HDMI 1080p IP address. Your granddaughter is trapped in London and needs money sent immediately. Punch this monkey! <laughs> Free health insurance. <laughs> Did you know? Call. Call that poor monkey. Call. You only need to push the monkey twice to open a new portal. Upgrading RAM. Hillary Clinton. <laughs> Insert diskette two. Remember, what is this? A web browser is not an operating system. <laughs> Why doesn't this punch card? Google Firefox Internet Explorer <laughs> Windows DOS. <laughs> it's quite simple. Oh, I need to do more exercises. So oh, I wanted to throw that to the floor. <laughs> Would you like to press yes? No or no? <laughs> no. No. No, not that no! <gasps> Video clip of a lady who was almost naked. <laughs> I don't want to be a cowboy anymore. Yes, you do. No, it's hot out there. And it's dirty. <laughs> And my horse smells bad, and I'm not very fast with my gun, Huge. and I, I left it on a cactus last week. <laughs> you don't want to be a cowboy anymore. You don't want to be a cowboy. Look, I know that our family has been cowboys for generations. That's right. We've been cowboys ever since there's been cowboys. Even before there were cowboys, we were the thing that was before the cowboys. I think they were knights. I'm not entirely sure. Because we've been cowboys for so long. I just... Don't want to be a cowboy. What, do you want to be an astronaut? I saw a buffalo last week. <laughs> And I want to take care of buffalo. They're cute. Do you want to be a buffalo boy? I don't know if I want to call it that. <laughs> I was thinking like a bison management technician. <laughs> but look at you. Mr. College Boy is a technician. I don't want to smell like horses anymore. I'd rather smell like the buffalo. Oh, give me a home with the buffalo or technical. <laughs> la, da, 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 da. Okay, if you're going to make fun of me for going to college, why did you send me to Harvard? <laughs> did you ask nicely? <laughs> <laughs> so I just thought, you know, I. I sell my share of the cows, and I'd buy a couple of buffalo. Did you know their meat is actually healthier for you than beef?
Ten gallon hat is poking me in the face. <laughs> <laughs> you saying something's healthier than beef? I'm just saying you had four heart attacks. <laughs> Today? <laughs> yeah? How many have you had? Just the one, but it was a really good one. <laughs> You're not trying hard enough. I'm trying. Trying real hard, but sometimes when a man grows up and finds that life on the farm just isn't enough anymore. So where are you gonna herd your buffalo in the city? Yeah, like City Buffalo. It's a thing. <laughs> <laughs> There's a whole city named after them. <laughs> you actually think there are buffalo in Buffalo? Well, why else would they call it that? Have you ever been to Buffalo? Welcome to Buffalo! <laughs> <laughs> you look like a stranger who's got a question on your mind. I <laughs> I just didn't expect one to be the mayor. Well, that's amazing. You know, uh, East Coasters, we have a different kind of education system. Yeah. Buffalo can be mayor. I, I, Would you I, like a tour of the mayor's mansion? Yes. Here it is. Wow. It's a room, mostly. It's a lot of Pendleton blankets. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Neil Young CD collection over here. Oh, it's a big fan of Neil Young. Why well, can't a buffalo be a fan of Neil Young's? No one says he can't. Yeah. I'll tell you what, you kind of lost me at trans, but well, I like sure. Harvest Moon. Yeah, it's all good. <laughs> so now you're going to marry a buffalo? <laughs> Look, Linda is a beautiful woman. <laughs> Buffalo. A beautiful buffalo woman. And she gets me. She supports my artistic aspirations. Is she Catholic? <laughs> You're hesitating. I don't know if I'm Catholic anymore. Oh. First you don't want to be a cowboy. Now you don't want to take communion? Well, that part I like. That's why I'm still on the fence. When was the last time you confessed in Buffalo Church? <laughs> uh, it's, it's, been, uh, it's been about three weeks. Human weeks? <laughs> no, no, no. Fair enough. Go on, my son. Well, last week, you know, was Thanksgiving. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was home with the family. Sure, sure. And I don't know how to say this. This said, just leave it out there. I ate turkey. Yeah, it's all good. Do uh, three buffaloes. <laughs> uh, uh, a hail buffalo. Okay. Hail Mary. And uh, you know, just, uh, just feel bad about what you did. <laughs> okay, well, I've got a head start on that. It's all good. Yeah. It's all good. All right. I'm going to wrap them on a pretty laid back buffalo priest. Yeah. <laughs> I got your absolution in this envelope. <laughs> well, I don't know. Life in the big city, I. That rural, rural life has been so good these days, but. I don't know. Living life as a rural gnome has just been so good to me. I just don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 This apartment complex has no yard whatsoever. <laughs> where am I? Where am I going to sit? I'm coming. <laughs> A lot of stairs, don't you know? Oh. Hey, Mister. <laughs> You want a date? <laughs> That's right, son. Mm -hmm. uh, perhaps I don't trust the pinwheel. <laughs> <laughs> I think she seems very nice. She's 
Just be placed right out, right out here next to um, uh, Janine. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> 